Hey guys, uh, I'm gonna show you today a weird situation that I have going on in this 328, well, 2009 328i. And I'm gonna show you what happened today. So, I've been working on this car for a while now, and car was cranking, it was not starting. Did a compression test and no compression some cylinders i mean we had to basically i mean check relays fuses uh, there was fuel on the rail i mean everything was just fine except it was not starting so what it came out to be after we popped off the valve cover as you can see it's so dirty as well but I mean, everything was fine. You see spark plugs. I mean, we did every test we could do. So what happened to be bad was, as you can see, this is my timing belt. And as you can see, there's one bolt at the end of the cams or the gears or not sure the exact name. So this is what goes in here. Let me take this off so you know exactly what it is so my brother by luck saw through the oil i mean through where you add the oil he saw that this cam was not spinning so he saw oh that's not spinning and they're supposed to be spinning so this one does you can see through that hole but this one wasn't so i mean I was standing on the side and I saw that was kind of leaning. I mean, it was it's loose as you can see, but it was popped off a little more. Kind of like that. See how the gap behind it is. So I saw it was kind of leaning and he's like, "Oh yeah." So we moved it around. I mean, the bolt was there, so we didn't have any idea, but we noticed that this was spinning freely and this one wasn't. This one's tight. So now, when he tried to tighten it, we noticed that this was broken off. See that? So, what I'm trying to do today is, I went in, I've already done a couple broken bolt extractions with this kit that I had, that I used to remove two broken bolts on the oil pan I mean pretty much this is what this is drill bit and this thing here it's called a just a extractor spiral screw extractor and drill set which I got at uh, Home Depot but I also found a big kit at Harbor Freight for like $8.99 I mean it's got a nice it's like a nice set, comes in this case and everything for storing. But anyways, I also went and bought a, I don't even know what this thing's called, angle drill add-on. Because when I try to do it here, as you can see my drill is a cheap one and gets in the way to reach in there without removing the fan and all this. So. My idea, let me set the camera here somewhere. Well, my idea is to reach the broken bolt like that in an angle. And of course, I'm gonna need both hands to hold it. So figure out a way to do it. But I also borrowed this drill, which is a lot smaller and it is able reach in there deep enough to where I can touch the bolt and hopefully just make a hole in it use the extractor spiral uh -oh, where you go there it is to pull it out and I'm gonna have a hard time because this thing is short I have to use one of the newer ones to put in there and reach it out I mean if that doesn't work I'm gonna have to undo the timing chain and everything that you're seeing here and then redo the timing and all that so I'm trying to avoid doing all that so I'm just trying to reach that 
but I'm gonna set this cardboard in there because as you can see there's those oil pads to keep that lubed so I'm trying to protect as much as I can from going in there I mean I might just have to pop this open to remove any piece of grinding bolt that went in there but I'm gonna do that for now hopefully I just pull it out with all the grinding pieces on top of it you don't want to use any paper because that will just melt and end up clogging the holes and you have no lubrication in there from oil so I'm gonna do that then I'm gonna vacuum it and hopefully that's enough I mean I don't know I'll try it but stay tuned we'll see what happens so we're gonna start the process now hopefully this works out just fine and saves me all this trouble and headaches that I've been going through on finding the problem so get, get, hopefully I get it centered enough to to where I don't have to do any extra work stop right there and as we can see the tip there you know, it's hard it's not focusing hard to see but the tip does have some pieces as you can see so I think we're probably all right See what the bolt looks like. So yeah, it's for sure the same color. I mean, let me reach in there with the light. I don't want to be doing the block instead of the actual bolt. You know, also pull this out. I mean, just to check on, see if it's catching anything. And oh, look at that! It's pretty hard to see it in a better camera, but there is definitely pieces that it's saved from going into the block. There, I mean, they're small, probably be caught in the filter, anyways. But I want to prevent from anything else happening. So I'm gonna clean this paper out, put it back in there. I'm going to check how it's looking. It's actually looking really good. 